I'm not ordinary offender, probably. I got a lot of stuff I got to fix. So I'm not satisfied with that performance. I got a lot of things I got to improve on. What is it like when you and Terry on, you, know, you guys are so close, you both have a game like that together. Is that extra special for you? Yeah, you know, playing with your brother, you know, that's a special moment. And, uh, you know, I, I love the, you know, the process that we've gone along together. And I love seeing him grow and love seeing him ball out. When you went down, uh, I think it was the first quarter, I mean, what, what happened there and why were you able to come back so quick? Uh, just a, it was more of trying to play for my teammates. You know, you know, there's a lot of game left, so they were trying to get it back on the field as much as fast as possible. Is it like a Charlie horse? Jalen, the way you're seeing it, you just look so much more comfortable command from, say, the first couple of games. I think experience is the best teacher. So the more reps I get, the more, you know, opportunities I have, I think I've seen everything much better. Um, but then again, I gotta improve and get better because um, you know I'm not I'm not a finished product, so I, I still gotta learn and grow. So after a six touchdown performance, you're not so pleased with your game today? No, I'm real frustrated. I got I got a lot of things I gotta fix and get better at. What was frustrating? Huh? What was frustrating? That you know missed a lot of c couple things down the field, uh, missed some balls uh, that, that I shouldn't be missing. Hold myself to a high standard, so I gotta improve and fix some things tomorrow. How important was it to you the way you, your guys, your teammates rallied around you? after those first couple games. And, and obviously, you can see that now. You talk to Terry and they talk about you and the way you've come along. Yeah, when we talk about team, you know, that's the biggest thing here. Um, we talk about team, we, we preach on that. And then we also talk about doing our job. But those guys, you know, I, I play for them. You know, there's no there's no uh, individual efforts. It's all a team effort. And uh, I think that's the biggest thing that we all know in the locker room is that we can't do it by ourselves. It takes all 11 guys, whoever's on the field. And, uh, you know, we're constantly growing. So I'm loving the guy's spirit and I'm loving how we're growing together. Terry, on said that there was actual rat traps in the locker room <laughs> and around practice. Uh, first of all, was that true? And did you step on them? Did you avoid them? <laughs> that was definitely different. You know, as we got on, we got used to it. But at first, it was kind of weird seeing the autumn rat traps all throughout the facility. So, so Coach, Coach Steven said he knew there were a lot of naysayers out there back in week one, week two, and then the way you guys have worked and got to this. How, how pleased and how satisfying is that for you guys to get to where you are yeah. right now? All motivation, all motivation for us. Because um, we knew there was going to be a long process. You know, We set short-term goals, we, start, we set long-term goals. And they're all achievable. Um, but the biggest thing we have to acknowledge is that we have to do our job. We have to do our job, and we have to uh, focus on the task at hand. And not worrying about external factors, more worrying about the things that's um, going to allow us to grow as a team. So I think that's the biggest thing for us. One more question. question. How's your leg feeling? And how was it managing that throughout the game? We won, so I'm, I'm real proud of that. I mean, enjoy it. I can't wait to get the Tuscaloosa and enjoy the win. Thanks, gentlemen. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.